Norwich City versus West Bromwich Albion. The Canaries take on the Baggies. Last time out, an action-packed 1-0 as Norwich player Borgia Saints picked up a red card and Thomas Asante found the goal to give West Brom the three points. West Brom recently signing striker from Bristol City, Andreas Weiman, with both teams on the back of some crucial wins. With West Brom making the trip down the A14 to Carra Road, the question is, who will win? Oh, hey, and we are back again with another video and it's a cold one today but we are off to Cow Road again I say it's cold but the sun is up there shining so you've got to look on the positive side but today let's look at where the league ranks Norwich sitting 11th whereas West Brom in the playoffs sitting 5th but from Bristol City down in 14th to Coventry in 7th there's only 4 points separating the sides so it will be relatively close you'd say today but equally, it's Norwich. I would say a 1-1 if I'm being optimistic. But I think West Brom are going to be 2-1 today. I think they're a better side than us. And without further ado, we will see you in there. So I'm now making my way onto the ground. You see I'm on a bit of a scenic route, but it's just me at the minute because Big Andy's struggling to park as it's really busy in Norwich and she can't get anyone to park. And we were going to be late for kickoff, so I had to hop out, start heading there. But the lineup is out and it's actually not a bad lineup. I think it's probably the best we could play at the minute, hoping we can get three points or at least a draw. So we're here with two West Brom fans, Paul and Daniel. What do you think the score will be today? Lovely to see you. Hey, listen, I'm going for a one-all draw, if I'm going to be honest with you. It's going to be a tough one. Oh, way back when that good. So I'm going for a 2-1 win there for the baggies. Come on. How did you get down to Norwich today? We came on the official supporters coach. It was an early start, if I'm going to be honest. We had to be at the ground for half past eight. It was a bit of a worry. He didn't get into his bed till one o'clock this morning due to his uh, reliance on alcohol. But that. we've made it. We've made it. <laughs> And you've just pulled Wolves in the cup. How do you feel about that? If I'm going to be honest with you, I'm not going to give it the big one. I'm very, very nervous. I'm excited. I can't wait. And you know some of the pressures on the Wolves. It'd be a really good game. It's my first ever derby. It's going to be really, really interesting. But yeah. I think the boys will hopefully do it. Yeah. But to be fair, in a derby, I think form goes out the window, really. It doesn't matter. Anything oh, yeah. can happen. You are very, yeah, that's a very good comment, that is. I said to that to opinion, you. my opinion, they've got the better players, in my opinion. But our home record is really good, so you never know. We're on a tough run, you know, because we've got walls and then we've got blues and then we've got dark, your yeah. your neighbours away, Ipswich, but no, anything oh. can happen in football, as you know. And would you say Wolves are the club you hate the most out of all the Midlands, oh, yeah. or is there any other? Oh, yeah. Hate them all. We call them, we like to call them politely, we keep it clean for the channel, the Dirty the, Dingles. The dirty Dingles, <laughs> that'll do. Thank you for your time. You're more than welcome. So Big Andy is back. What's the score today? Um, I think a very, very difficult one. Um, I think West Brom are better than Norwich. So I'm going with 2-1 West Brom. Though I'm, I like the Wolves, so really I should be saying Norwich to win, really. Yeah. And is it perfect time for some Big Andy facts? Certainly is. Here we are again. Morning. It's a bit of a blustery old frosty day, but it's game day as always on a Saturday, so we're looking forward to that. So we'll start with the, a bit of the usual, the league record between Norwich and West Brom. So since 1907, Norwich have had 21 wins, West Brom have had 29 wins, and there have been 17 draws. And a bit about today's opponents, West Bromwich Albion. They were formed in 1878. They're fondly known as the Baggies, and they play at a ground called the Hawthorns. Now, a lot of people, when it comes to record goal scorers of West Bromwich Albion, probably think that their leading scorer was somebody like Cyril Regis, or more recently Lee Hughes. 
but that all-time record goal scorer is a guy called Tony Brown, who played for them between 1963 and 1981, made 574 appearances and scored 218 goals. Well done, Tony. Fair play to the West Brom fans that turned out. Pretty decent turnout for them. And here come your teams, Norwich City versus West Brom. Singing loud and proud, the Albion fans. Early chances for West Brom, they just play it around us, nor is he to up in. It's a goal completely against the runner play, 13 minutes in, Josh Sargent, it's a counter attack, West Brom, they're trying to play this passing football around us, we close it down and we go and counter and Josh Sargent puts it away and this is a brilliant start. Sargent's a boy. West Brom very lucky to get away with that. We were going through and he's put him on the floor and it was only a yellow but could have possibly been a red. Norris trying to push for a second goal to make it a bigger gap. Norris just had three really good chances back to back to back and they need to be putting them away because if they want to win this, what they need to, they need to score them. Well, Norwich have really got away with that one there. West Brom have just scored. I think it's been ruled out for offside or a foul, something like that, but we've got lucky there. So it's half time here and it is currently 1 0 to Norwich. And I've just watched that goal back again and I think it was given for a handball. That's the only thing I can assume because he did not look offside. But I think Norwich, they've had a decent start considering how we've been playing recently. And I think. We just don't want a repeat of Leeds because Leeds we went 2-0 up and then we bottled it. So hopefully we can hold on to this lead and win. Fifty-five minutes in and both teams are really trying to get a goal. in there, 70 minutes played, Jonathan Rowe has been cut back and he's smashed it in. I'm buzzing, I can't believe it, we're 2-0 up in a game that this second half, West Brom have been all, I would say they've been dominating, we haven't had anything, and we've gone on the counter again and we've scored. Well then West Brom fans will not be happy, they've travelled all this way and they're 2-0 down in a game that they could be easily winning or drawing. Just pause right there, we are on the road to a thousand subscribers. 
If you'd like to join us and help our journey, make sure to subscribe. Anyway, back to the video. Five minutes added on here. And that's it here. No city two. West Brom nil. Full time here, and it's ended 2 0 to Norwich against West Brom. And that is a brilliant result for Norwich because it gets them up there, still fighting for playoffs. West Brom will be very disappointed. As you see, they have all just flooded out because they're going back to West Brom and they're disappointed with that because they came here probably expecting better considering the league position and how Norwich has been playing at the minute. But with Norwich, brilliant result. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bosh! Awesome. Now, to play with my main box. Grand, you're traveling with two dogs.